Hey YouTube, it's Lip Balm Queen here. Just wanted to come here today and I wanted to share a quick review on some lip balms I recently had sent to me from the company called Ham and Herbs. You can find them on Etsy. I will link all that information in the description box down below, including their Instagram. Um, they were kind enough to send me five of their new lip balms they have on their site to try and review for you guys. So I wanted to come here today and give you a quick review on these. Um, so in their collection of slider tin lip balms, which you know my love for slider tins, I'm so excited for these. This is their Hemp Lemon Balm. And the packaging is actually cute. They're called um, Lucky Lips Lip Balms. And they're organic completely. Um, and actual, the ingredients in this one I will mention to you guys. Um, they're beeswax, shea butter, virgin coconut oil, cold pressed hemp seed oil, extra virgin olive oil, lemon, uh, lemon balm. Uh, Candelua, castor oil, um, peppermint essential oil, tree, tea tree essential oil, and non-GMO vitamin E oil. So, really excited for this. I love the fact all of it's completely organic. And I love supporting um, smaller businesses and stuff, like just getting started and stuff. I really um, was really impressed with looking at their site. They had a bunch of different things to offer on their site. Um, and mainly, they're just trying to do a more organic way to use different products in life and I think that's really awesome they're trying to find the healthy organic way for everybody so this is their hemp lemon balm and I was really impressed with this their formula is really nice it's not thick it's not oily it's just like a nice thin consistency on your lips but it moisturizes and, it, and I'm really being serious about this it really does make your lips feel very moisturized um, like when you open it this is their lemon balm you can see um, where I've used a bunch of, I love this. Um, it does, it has a nice mint and lemon scent to it and it smells really good. And I love when you apply it to your lips. Like I said, it just gives you like a nice shine and it's a thin consistency. It feels really good though. It's very moisturizing. Um, I love the fact these go on clear and I love the scent, but I also love where it has the peppermint um, oil in it. It also gives you that cooling effect to your lips. I love that. So I was really impressed with this one. This is fantastic. So I really do um, recommend this one. I love this one. I use this one a lot at nighttime. I just love this. Um, and then we have lavender mint. And I would never have thought to put lavender and mint together. Like I just, like in my mind, I would have never put them together. But I'm glad they did because this is fantastic. Um, and it's a beautiful light purple shade. It's kind of coming off pink on the, um, it's like a light lavender, very, very light but it looks kind of pink on the um, on the actual viewfinder here. But I love it. I'm not like real huge on lavender scents, but this right here is enough lavender to where I can handle it. And I really like it. It smells so good. And um, you also get a hint of that, um, that mint scent as well. It smells so good. And I love this one. This is another one that I've been using at night too. I use these off and on. I use the lemon and I use this one at night. I love these two. This is fantastic. So if you're a huge lavender fan, you'd really like this. This is really nice. Um, and then we have um, peppermint hot chocolate. This one is by far my absolute favorite that they have in this collection um, because I'm a chocolate fiend. I love anything chocolate and I love anything peppermint. So the two of those together, there you go. You know it's going to be my favorite. So it's peppermint hot chocolate. And when you open it, it is a brown shade. It doesn't go on brown though, it's just a clear tint to your lips. Um, but oh my gosh, it smells so good. It reminds me of um, like your peppermint mochas you get in the uh, winter time. Oh my gosh, I love this. It smells so good. And like, I just swatched it for you guys. See how shiny it is? It's really beautiful. It goes on thin. It's moisturizing. You don't have to worry about any weird like color payoff from it. It's just really nice. I really do recommend these. These are fantastic. And if you're wanting to go the organic way, cruelty-free way, this is the way to do it. So um, I was really excited for this. So then we have Orange Dreamsicle. And this one smells so good. God, all these just smell amazing. Um, and I figured this one would be orange, but it was yellow. It really surprised me when I opened it because I thought it'd be orange. Oh my goodness. Okay. I'm going to tell you guys what I think this reminds me of. Like, it definitely reminds me of, like, the Dreamsicle, um you know, popsicles, they're like orange with the cream in the center. Um, it does remind me of that. But when I smell it, I also think of, you know, I think it's Russell Stover's makes it, like when they make the big Valentine's Day heart candies. 
um, and you get the assorted chocolates. You know the one that has the chocolate with the orange like cream in the middle? That's what this smells like to me. I, it just reminds me of that cream that they have inside that chocolate is what it smells like to me. And it smells fantastic. I love this. I highly recommend this one as well. This one's fantastic. I love it. Especially if you're a sucker for orange, you'll love this one. It smells so good. Because you definitely get like the orange, um, like you get the citrusy scent from the orange. But um, you also get like a sweet vanilla as well. And it's just really nice and I just love it. So very impressed with this one. And then the last one in this awesome set is Cinnamon Spice. And I tried this one, um, was it Sunday night? Yeah, I, I had tried all of them except for the Cinnamon Spice. And I was like, gosh, I need to try this one so I can do my review on it. And when I applied this, I figured it was going to be, you know, just, you know, the basic cinnamon that you always get with like lip balms and stuff. This is fantastic. Oh my gosh, it's an authentic cinnamon. Like... It smells like cinnamon and nutmeg and a bunch of different spices. It smells so good. And um, I'm actually going to look on the ingredients to see what all's in it because that's what it smells like. It smells like cinnamon and nutmeg and maybe cloves. It just smells really good. And this one here has, let's see, beeswax, shea butter, virgin coconut oil, extra virgin olive oil, castor oil, cinnamon, paprika, um, peppermint essential oil, cinnamon bark essential oil, clove. I did have clove in it. Um essential oil and non-gmo vitamin e oil i didn't see nutmeg in here but maybe it's the clove that i'm smelling it smells so good guys i do recommend this and if you love cinnamon like authentic cinnamon scents and stuff and like flavors you would love that because this smells fantastic so i definitely do recommend this company i love the fact that they're a smaller business getting started on etsy i think that's fantastic and i really do love supporting um smaller companies because um i have found some really awesome hidden gems on etsy um and i do go on there like all the time i'm always on there looking at different companies and different products they offer and stuff and you know if they're cruelty free and if they're uh you know, if they don't have like any parabens or any weird chemicals in it. I try to find products that I know are uh, chemical free, cruelty free, um, you know, just stuff like that for you guys because I want to make sure that um, I offer that as well because a lot of lip balms I review are like synthetic lip balms that you can buy anywhere. But I also want to offer some that are organic as well for you guys because I know a lot of people are looking for like organic and cruelty free and, um, you know, I like to put that option out there for you guys as well. So definitely check out their um, website or their Etsy page and definitely follow them on Instagram. I will link all that in the description box down below for you guys. And on their site, these retail for $350 a piece. So I think that's a fantastic buy for this because you get a lot of product in there for $350. Like, that's a pretty good amount for $350. And this is a fantastic lip balm. So uh, I just love the, the um, peppermint hot chocolate. It smells so good. Um, it's my favorite. So I wanted to thank um, this amazing company for sending me this to try out for you guys and review. And I'm always honest on my reviews. If I don't like a product, I will definitely let you guys know. So don't ever think just because I get it for free that, that I'm going to lie and say it's fantastic. And it's not because this is a fantastic brand. And I really do love it. And I definitely recommend it. So definitely check them out. And I hope you have a blessed day. Thanks. Bye.